What's up y'all, Cody Allen here, and today I am going to be going over the age-old question that fitness professionals constantly get, and that is, what supplements should I be taking? In short, the answer is always going to be, it depends. Everybody has different goals, there's so much variance from person to person, so it depends is always gonna be a safe answer, but being an optimal nutrition athlete, I was fortunate enough to have them send me some products that are supplements that I live and die by. Also, with that being said, you guys can use my code, which is just my name, Cody and the number 15 at Optimum Nutrition's website. That'll give you 15% off your entire cart and free shipping in the US. So without further ado, let's jump into it. So first things first, I wanna come on here and just say that myself and Owen included, we are advocates of being food first, meaning that if you can hit your macronutrients just through eating whole foods, and I'm big on saying whole foods because I don't want you guys out there eating double doubles, just hit your protein, fats, and carbs, then that's what you should be doing. But supplements are an amazing tool to supplement your diet in order to hit these macronutrients that aren't always easy to hit. Myself personally, I'm hitting 255 grams of protein a day. A day. That is a lot of food to eat. So something like a whey protein shake helps me out immensely. All right, so why whey protein? I choose whey protein because the gold standard whey protein from Optimum Nutrition is made from 100% whey protein isolates. Whey protein isolates are the purest form of whey protein and thus making it one of the fastest digestible proteins that you can get into your system post-workout to aid in the recovery and muscle growth. Quality of protein is so, so vital when talking about how can I most efficiently grow my muscle, how can I most efficiently recover my muscle from breaking down all my muscle fibers during my workout. Of the three macronutrients, proteins, carbs, and fats, protein is probably the most vital to your overall health and well-being. If you are a vegan and you can't do dairy products, which a whey protein is, Optimum Nutrition offers an awesome plant-based protein which y'all can also get from the website using my code for 15% off. All right, so why do I love Owen's protein in particular? Uh, the main reason is because it is a complete protein. So their 100% whey protein comes with over five and a half grams of naturally occurring brand chain amino acids, over four grams of glutamine within a single serving of this protein. So when I talk about a complete protein, I'm talking about a protein that can really help me aid in the recovery of the muscle fibers that I just broke down in my body. That is massive for me when I'm looking for a protein that's easily digestible, one that's not hard on the stomach, one that I can take continually to help me fit my protein macronutrient goal time and time again. Not to mention, it is super easy to mix. Clumpy proteins are the Gosh. Clumpy supplements just in general, Owen does a really good job of that, making a non-clumpy supplement. There's not a lot of grit to the powder. So let's say that you do want to blend it in like with blueberries or frozen bananas or something like that. This is a protein that I suggest 10 times out of 10 for that reason alone. Now that we talked protein, I want to get to the next supplement, which is the most scientifically backed studied supplement that has ever been out there, studied however you want to say it, and that is creatine monohydrate. What is creatine? Creatine monohydrate has been known when taken in the appropriate times to increase your phosphocreatine within your body. When taking and dosing creatine monohydrate appropriately, it's been shown to increase your ATP levels within your body. ATP levels are somewhat like the energy currency within your body. There's a lot of positives to having an abundance of APP within your body. Some of the downsides that may happen, some of the undesirable things rather that may happen when you're at lower levels of ATP are thinning and graying of the hair, increased wrinkles, but but, but if you dose creatine appropriately, you can stave off some of these side effects of not having increased ATP levels. So why consistently take creatine monohydrate? Well, studies have shown that creatine monohydrate helps support muscle size, muscle growth, muscle strength, and even muscle endurance. Strong, healthy muscles, creatine helps support all of that. Creatine monohydrate, and coming from Optimum Nutrition, comes from two and a half grams of creatine monohydrate per serving. I would recommend, studies have shown, that 
three to five grams a day is probably okay, probably leaning more towards three for the everyday person, as far as a serving on a daily basis. Remember at the beginning of this YouTube video, I said, I'm food first. I'm a food first advocate. You can get creatine and do get creatine from some of your meats, red meat especially. But in order to get roughly three grams of creatine monohydrate, you need to eat 16 ounces of beef. I can for sure eat 16 ounces of beef. I don't know if you guys can, but we're talking about efficiently. So can you efficiently get creatine monohydrate just from a supplement? The answer in short, yes. So big creatine guy, highly suggest it for every single person, even take it on your days off. So to wrap this whole thing up, creatine, protein, yes. Great, great, great supplements to take right after your workout. Again, I'm a huge advocate of the Optimum Nutrition brand. I stand by all of their supplements. You guys can get any of their supplements from the Optimum Nutrition, that is www.optimumnutrition.com from their website. And by using my name, Cody, and the number 15, you'll get 15% off. You'll get free shipping in the US. And I promise you that you guys will not be disappointed. If you guys do like videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. Also like, comment any questions or concerns that you might have. But if not, get after it, y'all.